We have about 70,000 square feet of green roofs within the city. There's probably between 10 and 15 projects that are currently under design. Right now we can say that we have the largest amount per capita of green roofs in the, in the United States. That's about one square foot per person in the city. TELUS 360 is one of nine vegetated roofs that have been installed in Lancaster City over the last three years. This is uh, approximately 9,000 square foot roof. The makeup of the roof is there is a new membrane installed uh, along with a fabric, a filter board, which is essentially like an egg crate board, a fabric root barrier on top of that, and then three inches of growing media with the sedums planted on top. We put in a green roof, we thought it'd be cool, we had never done one. Um, we're contractors is our background and um, somebody, I think it was Fritz actually came up with the idea that they were doing green roofs around town and it just sounded like a good idea. Typically a roof like this captures and retains between 50 and 70 percent of rainfall. It slows down up to 90 percent of the rain that hits it, which is extremely important for Lancaster City. I know how important it is. I mean, I know how important it is to be green and to do our part. My brother Fred and I renovated this historic space that was the Western Market from the 1800s. The whole idea of putting the green roof made a lot of sense to us and being a bay lover, someone who goes in boats on the bay and understands the runoff of the aging sewer system of this city that we need to do our part with so much impervious space. For the additional cost that cost us, we got 15 extra years on our roofing system. There's just something nice about having the sounds of the city, but having the greenscape all around you that um, we thought we'd like it. It adds also life to our building. The town was tremendously helpful and supportful in us um, doing the work, um, so we just said, why not? We have a green roof outside our kitchen window here. It's growing with um, sedums, which are um, perennial plants. It's green through the spring, summer, and fall, and then in the winter, it's more muted, but not totally dead. We knew we'd be building a sort of flat roof straight out from the kitchen window, and we were trying to think of ways to be both more sustainable environmentally and also more aesthetically interesting and it's been a good experience. I would indeed encourage people to do it because the the upside is far greater than the downside of maintaining a, a green roof for what it's going to do for our environment and for our community.